On the third round, we're going to start in one of the one chain spaces on any one of the sides. And as we do each round, we'll just choose any one chain space in a different place to where we've worked on an earlier round. We're going to start with a standing treble just here. So for that, we pick up the yarn, hold it with our hook, bring the yarn over the hook, hold it with our finger, and then insert the tip of the hook into a one chain space. Bring the yarn over the hook, pull it through the one chain space, bring the yarn over the hook, and hold on to these two so this tail here doesn't escape, and bring this loop here through these two loops already on the hook. And we're going to follow that with one chain. Bring the yarn over the hook and one chain. And that's our standing treble to start. It's the same as we used on the second round, but there we were working in one of the corners. We're going to put another treble beside it here. Now when I was doing the first two rounds, I used a um, beginner's method, which is not as efficient. And today I'm going to use a couple of different methods, one using the knife hold, which is where you hold the, knife, the hook like a knife, and the other is the pencil hold, where you hold it like a pencil. I'll start off with the knife hold. For that I bring the yarn down between my fingers a bit further, and give myself a bit of space, so that I can just take the hook straight under the yarn, like this. The yarn is taking the same path that it did when I was winding it with my hand. It's just that now I'm grabbing it directly with the hook. We'll stop there and leave that. We'll finish that group of three at the end. And now that we're at a corner uh, section, we'll put another corner in a corner. On the sides we put one chain between the groups of three trebles, and now we'll work a corner and a corner, and that was the three treble, three chain, three treble, all into the corner space. One. Two. Three. Three chain. One, two, three, and then another three treble in the same space. One, two, Three. I just have to give myself some more yarn. Now the next space is a one chain space. So into that we're going to work a group of three trebles. One chain because we're travelling on the side between groups. And three treble into this space. One. three, one chain, and we're going to put a corner sequence in the next corner. One, two, three, three chain, and three more trebles in the same space. Now the knife hold is not my normal hold, I always feel a little bit awkward working this way, so in a moment I'm going to swap to the pencil hold or pen hold and show you how I do that. I'm going to carry on around the whole square putting 
three dribbles in each one chain space and whole corner sequences in every corner hole. And then I'll carry on around and we'll finish this off when we get to the end.